Hi there, my name is Vaso and today I'm going to show you how I record my ECG with the Eindhoven leads called 1, 2 and 3. We do this with our differential amplifier, which is this one here. Now, remember that every bio amplifier has got three inputs, positive, negative and ground. And these need to be connected to my limbs for the Eindhoven ECG. The convention is to use the left arm, the right arm and the left foot for the electrode placements. And this gives us three combinations or three different signals called Eindhoven 1, 2 and 3 leads. And they can be symbolized by the famous Eindhoven triangle. The tip of the arrow indicates the positive and the opposite end the negative input. And ground is always connected to the right foot. So now let us measure the Eindhoven 1, 2 and 3 leads one by one. Eindhoven 1. We take the positive input, which is the first cable here, the yellow cable, and connect this one to the left arm there. Then we take the negative input, last cable here, and connect this one to the right arm. And we take ground, blue cable, and connect this one to the right foot. There. So this was Eindhoven 1. Now let's go to Eindhoven 2. We take the positive input, yellow cable, and connect this one to the left foot. There. The negative input, which is my red cable, I connect this one to the right arm, and ground, blue cable here, stays connected to the right foot. Eindhoven 3. Positive input, connect it to the left foot. Then we take the negative input, last cable here, and connect this one to the left arm, there. And ground stays connected to the right foot. So now we have got three different traces. A normal ECG machine would record these three traces simultaneously using three different amplifiers. And with the help of these three traces, it is now possible to measure the angle of the electrical field of the heart using the Eindhoven triangle. And to do this, we take the R peaks of 1, 2 and 3 and back project their amplitude with the help of the Eindhoven triangle to obtain the angle. In my case, the angle is 65 degrees. 